Hey there Cubers, it's Belgian Speed Cuber here and in this video I have a second unboxing from Colmo Puzzles. I'm really excited to do this one and I hope you guys are too. Roll the intro! I would like to take this opportunity to thank Colmo Puzzles for sending me these awesome puzzles. Um, yeah, let's get into the second one and check it out. Wait, first I have to... No. Oh man, I'm going to have to disassemble this puzzle first. <laughs> but it's so beautiful though. <laughs> I don't want to disassemble it, but I have to. Yeah, I don't have any space left to uh, make the other puzzle. So um, yeah, I'm going to disassemble it. Okay, so now that the cat is back in its box, let's check out box number two. And as I said in my previous video, I definitely want to say that, yeah, the wooden smell of it is very pleasing. The puzzles itself are very well packaged and um, yeah, just look at the box. It looks very premium. Um, they are engraved as well, wooden jigsaw puzzles. Como.co um, engraved animals on the side as well. And this puzzle has 184 pieces, whereas the cat had uh, 367 pieces. So um, I'm not going to say this is going to be an easier puzzle. <laughs> uh, yeah, just uh, let's check it out. Okay, so the same packaging as before, very pleasing. <laughs> oh, let's get all of them. The puzzle is very detailed, it has some <laughs> very cool looking pieces. Uh, the box it comes in is an MDF type wood. Um, and the pieces itself are uh, made out of plywood and they have been laser cut into shapes. And what's also cool about Colmo puzzles is that they fully produce their puzzles themselves. Uh, they don't outsource anything. So um, yeah, cool. Let's solve this puzzle. Look at this tiny piece. Look at it. Okay, so the second puzzle Colmo Puzzle sent me was, yeah, it was a real treat. Very satisfying to solve again. If you want to see the first puzzle I made, uh, I'm gonna put a link right here. I want to thank Colmo Puzzles again for sending me these great quality puzzles. I can't stress this enough, this is very well made. Um, and I'm going to put uh, links in the description where you can buy them. It is very calming and pleasing to solve on. Uh, the puzzle itself is very high quality. Uh, the wood smell on it is, yeah, also pleasing. I always studied woodwork in school, so uh, I'm very pleased with this puzzle. Sometimes a piece can be next to the piece where it goes and you can't see it. And it, it is, yeah, it's a tough puzzle to solve for me. I don't know if it will be the same for skilled puzzlers, but it was very satisfying to do. Like I shown with the pictures, these are very detailed. And like I said in my previous video, I should have used a mat to uh, solve the puzzle on because it's 
uh, it's shifting a bit. That's not a negative thing. Uh, the pieces are very well crafted and uh, laser cut. The same goes for this puzzle. The last pieces, you, you would have think I'm onto the last five pieces. This going, this is going to be a piece of cake, but it really wasn't. And that's that is making this puzzle so fun. So um, again, if you want to buy this puzzle, I'll put a link in the description. Como Puzzles also has an Instagram page, so the link will be in the description as well. I'll go give them a follow. So if you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. Uh, I make videos like this on here all the time. Puzzle reviews, cube reviews, uh, and so on. Thank you guys for watching. Belgian Speedcuber out.